Um, let's see. Let's go ahead and move on. Let's see. I will give some quick. Okay, I'll do this, and then we can then we can talk about near. Uh, I so I have bought. Where did I put it? Where is it? Okay, so I bought a three three movie pack Blu-ray of the CG <laughs> Resident Evil movies, and in, in anticipation of uh the new one coming out, uh, Infinite Darkness. Um, I gotta say, um, not very impressed with the first yeah, movie in this not pack. Great. But they're fun. <laughs> okay, okay. What, what got me like interested in them is that um, I, I saw that stupid fucking cutscene. Uh, I, I guess I guess it's from Vendetta where they're doing one dude. With yeah, the, like, on the, like thing just. <laughs> they're just running around in circles and shooting each other. See, it's so, so dumb, but it, it it's amazing. But yeah, like like this movie. Um, I mean, I, I have all the live action movies. Some of them are guilty pleasures. Others are just like kind of boring and drab. Um, but man, I, I know this movie came out like I think 2000. The first one came out 2008, I believe. And but just like the voice acting is like so yeah. god awful. Like like Claire is, is 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 she's OK, but like Leon is he's like a husk. Like he has nothing of his personality from two or four. He, he has like no smart ass attitude to him he's just like exists and i'm just like this is my favorite resident evil character why why are you not being your character um listen the movies are fun for what they are you don't go in expecting a masterpiece i'm There's not expecting a mass i i my i like i like garbage i literally showed this on screen <laughs> saw is a horrible franchise that i love but just like even in comparison to the live action movies, it, it's probably my least favorite Resident Evil movie to date. Like, yeah, like, like I swear I, they get better as they go on. That's what I'm hoping. I like at, at least I'm hoping for that gunfight action scene to just be as perfect as I've seen before. The last film before Infinite Darkness, the one that you're talking about, I was very lucky and I saw that one in theaters. And it was like a super fun experience because you had people who were only there because they knew the live action films and they just saw Resident Evil and they were so confused. Then you have the people who played the games and were like, fuck yeah, give me this canon shit. And just like, it's so fucking nuts. And the, the movies are off the rails and they're canon too, which is the crazy part. So like, you want to know what happens between the games? You gotta watch the animated CGI films because this is literally what happens. And it's just they're fun, so it's cool that you're that you're finally taking a look at them because I find them. Yeah, I, I definitely want to give them a fair shake. Like I, I'm definitely not expecting a masterpiece whatsoever. But even with Degeneration, I was just like, I don't, it's something to watch. I wasn't like actively having a great time with it. So definitely have higher hopes for the following two at the very least. But if if I had to rank all of the Resident Evil movies, it would be. Some in an airport are fun. It's different. <laughs> that that's true. <laughs> um, I, I think if I were to do like best to worst, I would do Apocalypse, which is the second one. Um, Retribution because it brings back Barry, and there's some good, dumb, stupid what? ass shit in there. It's, so bad. it's it's so good. It's so it is so bad. good. It's not good. Um, after that is the first Resident Evil, then Extinction because it's super bland and boring. Afterlife is just dumb. And final chapter because it kills Wesker with a door. My boy Wesker goes out and five by a rocket launcher in a volcano, and then in the movie they kill him. A door hits his foot. He's like, "Oh no, I got an ouchie. I'm dead." Good. Uh, after that, that generation. Yeah, but, I mean, so would I. Like, ouch! What the fuck? Because because at least with these live action ones, like they're bad in a way that I can laugh at them. Whereas with degeneration, I'm just like, eh. Like I'd rather have something be like laughably god awful. Because at least I can get a laugh out of it, out of just like just existing. Um, yeah. Watch, watch Apocalypse and Retribution. Apocalypse, is two really best good. ones. Apocalypse is too good, and everyone that has their own opinion can just get their own opinion somewhere else. <laughs>